Give us an update, if you would, on the players who are perhaps in limbo. Certainly from the the uh, public's point of view. The likes of Ryan Tafazoli, Chris Clements, Reggie Lamb, those type of players who have not yet signed. What's the latest? Um, Reggie and Taff will be with us as we've... Um We've got options on their contract. Um, obviously, they they were happy to uh, be part of what we're doing. Reggie's been away on international duty, um, and Taft's been on holiday. So, um, them guys will stay with us. Um, Chris wants to stay on board with us. We're just trying to sort his um, his deal out, which um, we're obviously trying to get the the best deal for the club and for Chris. Um, but them, them boys, they they want to be part of the journey and part of what's going on here. So uh, I, f- I see no no problems on on their behalf. What are your priorities now? I think we still need to um, bring in a couple more bodies in the defensive areas. We we're still looking at a few bits and bobs. Obviously, goalkeeper is a huge one. Um, we've spoke to a number of uh, candidates for that position and. Um, I'm not going to rush into that one. I want to make sure that one's right. It's a big one for us, and um, I think since we we lost Maz, we haven't really replaced that that figurehead. So um, we're speaking to some real good good quality keepers, ranging from uh, higher levels to the the experienced, uh, efficient um, goalkeeper that, that's got good knowledge of our league. So we we've got a range of people we're looking at and it, it's one that I do want experience in um, because I feel it's a vital part and to, to marshal and to lead a, a back four then you uh, you need to have that character in, in between the sticks. Thank you Adam. Thanks Mark.